again, everyone, and welcome to another midweek snack. We have uh, some Quest cookies. This is, I believe, the third one of these we've done, but from a source, very reliable, <laughs> good, good person, but now she said that the peanut butter chocolate chip was the way to go. At least I think that's what she said. If, if she said something else, maybe I didn't listen very well. But yeah, friend Rebecca, who I'm going to leave her channel down below. If you're interested in classical music, uh, really great uh, violin playing, go check her channel out again down in the description. Help her out with a couple of subs, and, uh, and then I would appreciate it. But she's a very, very talented musician. I used to play violin at one point when I was a younger kid, and then promptly fell out of love with it. Uh, but she obviously didn't, and is much better. But again, if <laughs> hopefully this was the one that she recommended. Oh, goodness. Um, the peanut butter cookie that I tried, I didn't particularly care for. There was a little bit of an off taste. Um, we did, what was it, the double chocolate one, I think. And that one was actually pretty good. Uh, so I love peanut butter, though. I do love peanut butter. I like peanut butter chocolate. And I'm just hoping that this doesn't have the same sort of off taste, you know, it's not terrible, but it's definitely different. So here are the nutritional facts on the cookie, whopping 220 calories there, lots of stuff in there, very little sugar, again, one gram of sugar, which is why I've always liked Quest products, because they, they minimalize the sugar intake. Ingredients list, if you're interested in that. Let's go ahead and open this bad boy up. All right. Looks like we got some little free uh, peanuts in there, maybe. Again, kind of looks like a muffin top. <laughs> At least on the top. The bottom, oh yeah, cookie muffin top. Anyway, let's try her out. Yeah, there, there's a little bit of a taste there. But it's not as severe as the peanut butter cookie. But it is there. It is still there a bit. So whatever like peanut butter protein powder they're using, I'm assuming it's probably just whey protein. I mean, I could look at the actual ingredients list. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's a whey protein powder. They do say butter is in here. Chocolate. Let me see what their sweeteners are. Uh, nah, that's what it's. It's flipping stevia. That's what it is. I think I pointed that out on the last cookie. I just don't care about. I, I don't care for stevia. Very rarely have I ever said, "Oh, this is good," and then figure it out it has stevia in it. It's just so. It's so fake sweet. But I will say this, it is better than the normal peanut butter cookie. And I don't know if that's the chocolate or if they're doing some different ratios, but, but the funny thing is, I think I'd rather have their bars in this flavor than, this, than the cookie. But anyway, it is better. So if you if you do want peanut butter cookie, Quest cookie, I would go for this one over the standard peanut butter. This just seems to have a little bit less of that off taste, which I'm just going to say is probably the stevia. But I'm sure there are people out there, some of you who don't mind stevia. But anyway, that's it for today. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. In the comments down below, leave me any suggestions you might have for future videos. I definitely appreciate it. You can send in things for me to review. P.O. Box is in the description. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and we'll catch you on the next one. See ya.